without fail, when I'm out and about just doing my thing, I always end up watching some people. And the reason I'm watching them is because of the way they move. So it could be the way they walk, um, how they cycle, how they jump, skate, turn. Sometimes it's simply how they stand. The, there is a peculiarity about what they're doing that leads to uh, these questions suddenly jumping into my head. So why would somebody walk that way? Or what kind of person walks like that? Uh, or uh, I see somebody eating chicken and I'm saying, have I ever seen anybody eat chicken with such grace and you know just all these things but those questions they sort of build up and they fl float around and very quickly other thoughts latch on and a story starts to grow um, it's not just by the way it's not just human beings the movement of human beings it could be uh, there's a dog that has its very own way of moving from a to b or i often sit out on the waterfront uh, the river i and you see unusual things. So the other day, for example, I saw the wind vanes or the you know components of this electricity generating um, windmill floating along, along the river. It had hitched a ride on this giant boat. And you sort of suddenly have a story about those things. So I think it's just, the fact of the matter is, any way you look, any time of the day, it doesn't matter, there is always something somewhere that is able to kickstart a story. At least that's my version of things.